Hey guys, welcome back to day four of Week of Wow, focusing on the Sims 4 Growing Together expansion pack. So today we are going to be taking a closer look, hopefully, um, at like possibly getting laid off or like coworker enemy kind of things. However, I have yet to actually boost Dax up to the branch selection. Um, cause I'm hoping that if he's further up, there's more likely something going to happen. Um, and then we're also going to get Madison pregnant again so that we can have a baby shower. Um, but I went ahead and put Aria in the high chair. I gave her a makeover as well. Put her in the high chair, gave her a ham and cheese sandwich, and a quirk was revealed. She is a picky eater. Arya is quite particular about her food. Picky eater toddlers are less likely to like their food, and they're more likely to refuse it altogether, which can be a little messy. They also won't eat on their own until they're very hungry. So I could see, <laughs> I could see this being really annoying, but I just wanted to kind of show that off and, um, I don't just just get rid of it. Um, show that off and now I'm going to cut out and go bump Dax up because I don't know what cheat I need for that. Okay, so I've promoted him up to Joke Smith. Again, hoping that by doing that he will um, be more likely to have a workplace rival, get laid off, stuff like that. Um, I should probably, he probably needs to work on his comedy skill though. Okay, read first book, learn to talk, study shape. Okay, so I don't know. To okay, toddlers cannot be put in the crib anymore, which I kind of figured, but I just thought I would check. So we'll get. This has kind of like a blue tint to it. I don't care. Is there one with like a. Like that. There we go. Um, oh, actually. I'm going to get rid of, well, we're going to have a baby. Okay, we'll get some nesting blocks. Uh, there they are. I guess I'll just leave this over here. <coughs> okay, also, because I just promoted Dax a whole bunch, he now has the ambitious trait. So, um, I'm just going to teleport her up here and... We'll work on stacking the blocks. Maybe we'll take a quick nap. Um, what are you doing? Uh, then we're gonna actually have them try for a baby. The thing is, like, they don't know like anybody <laughs> to invite to a baby shower, which is kind of my concern. Take pregnancy test, please. And we're pregnant. Okay. So can I schedule? An event for Sat- I don't- I don't know. I don't know if Saturday is a good idea. Okay, I'm going to- we're gonna cancel Love Day. Sorry, Love Day. <laughs> and we're actually gonna plan it for tomorrow just to be sure that we can do it. Okay. Baby shower! Gather friends and family to celebrate the expansion of your household, whether you're pregnant or adopting, bringing a new family member into your home is a major life moment worthy of some commotion. Expecting parent is Madison. Guess <laughs> Kyle, <laughs> Kyle, I guess. Oh, we are very incompatible with Kyle. Um, Dax might be at work. I don't need a caterer. Um, I'm going to do it at our house. At, oh, what time does he work, though? Oh, hold on. He works from 2 to 8. So what if I did it at, like, 10 in the morning? Um, Havermill residence. We're gonna do it at 10 a.m. Hopefully everybody can kind of get around by then. Oh, look at the little picture for it. Cute. Okay. I'm hoping it'll be done by the time Dax goes to work. Does she still hate wake-ups? No. Oh, now we Can she have her diaper changed still? With the, um changing table or is that an infant only thing? Okay, I'm gonna go take a shower, put that away, clean out spoiled food. We need to serve up some breakfast food as well. Um, 
Maybe pancakes. Arya has developed a quirk. Hates bedtime. Arya really resists having to go to bed. Toddlers in with the hates bedtime quirk tend to wake up shortly after falling asleep and will often ask their caregiver for various things to avoid sleeping. They also won't choose to sleep on their own until they're very, very tired. I've been trying to have her nap because she hasn't been wanting to sleep. Now I understand why. Okay, so I was trying to get Arya's social up, and we got this pop-up for a new family dynamic of supportive. Some older Sims have a knack for providing reassurance and emotional support for their younger family members. The older Sim can serve as a good role model, sharing their many life experiences to help guide the younger Sim through life. Recently, it seems like Arya and Madison have this type of relationship. When family members have a supportive family dynamic, both Sims will actively provide affection and compliments to each other. The older Sim will actively seek to console or cheer up the younger Sim, and the younger Sim feels comfortable venting complaints or asking for, a bit, for help a bit more. Would you say Arya and Madison have a supportive family dynamic? I mean, yeah. <laughs> like, she's a toddler. I don't really know what she's gonna like vent about also because she only sleeps when she's really tired um she got like halfway her meat her bar got like halfway up and then she decided she wasn't tired no more so um why don't you go potty train aria go and use the uh actually you know what we're gonna use this bathroom and take a speedy shower I keep forgetting that she's athletic. Strict! When it comes to Dax and Arya, a sense of order seems to be abound as the younger Sim has a deep respect for their older family member, often meeting the older Sim's high expectations. For family members with a strict family dynamic, the older Sim will ask the younger Sim to do things like cleaning more, and the younger Sim will generally avoid rebelling, though both might get stressed, more stressed overall. Sure. Interesting. I don't know how many different family dynamics there are. Oh, do not like showering with your toddler in the room. Also, I have yet to get any bills. I've been playing for a couple of days, so I don't really know what's going on there. People should start showing up soon as well. You should just go rock. You're supposed to show up at 10 is when the event starts. Yes. Okay, main goal. Talk about the baby. So gush about new baby. Congratulate the expect- I am the expecting parent. <laughs> um... Small talk, um, gush about new baby. Oh, pretty dress. Um, oh, we're dancing. Okay, let's tell a funny story. <coughs> and, oh, here comes Arya. Congratulate, I don't know where that is. Would that be under compliment? Not complaints, compliments. Congratulate! Woo! Why is Dax the only one not dressed? Change outfit to party outfit. What is a baby shower gift? Oh, they're toys? Or potty chairs? Or building blocks? I don't need any of that. You can tell another funny story. What was that San Sequoia secret thing I just saw? Also, share San Sequoia secrets. I just want to know what that is. Okay, tell a funny story. You know that clown painting over at the recreation center? Pretty sure it's haunted. No, not pretty sure. Definitely sure. Okay, gush about new baby again. I don't need to do that. I need to congratulate. Congratulate. Um, tell another funny story. Oh, there. Thanks for coming. I haven't done like anything. I feel like sh they're not doing what I ask them to. I'm asking her to thank him. She doesn't. I keep I queued up a bunch of stuff for Dax to do and he didn't. Hello. Thanks for coming. <laughs> then you can dance with Arya. Arya's having a blast. Oh no, work for Dax starts in an hour. Uh, use celebration cannon. I don't know where that is. Gosh, there's so much stuff. You celebration. Place the celebration cannon. Oh, it's a thing you buy. Celebration cannon. Go and place it out in the front yard. <laughs> Over here. 
I'll do a white and green one. Okay, I'll do that in a second. Can you please congratulate her? Congratulate. There we go. Sure, but I don't have baby gifts. Um, these are so expensive. Okay. Give baby shower gift. Oh, I already had stuff in my inventory. Oh, no, 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 no. No, don't do that. Discipline, firm, express disappointment for making a mess. Or not, I guess she's just not doing that. <coughs> Gush about new baby. Um, guess new baby's future career. Ask baby's due date. I don't know if that one counts. Offer new parenting advice, even though it's your child. Uh, go on to work. I'm gonna have her come blow the- fire the baby shower cannon. I don't want to talk to Kyle anymore. Oh, the house is dirty. I don't know if she's the biggest fan of the, of the cannon. She is in her second trimester, by the way. Okay, take photos. Can we... Can't take a photo with Arya? I can't, okay. Um, okay. Take a selfie. Um, there we go, that's a cute one. It does not give off baby shower vibes, but... <laughs> cute picture. What if we went and took a- I kind of want a picture of Aria dancing. Can you come up here and dance? You go here as well. I don't have to take another picture, but I kind of want to now. Okay, take photo. Oh, you're dancing. Can I not change- can I not change? What? Take photo of Aria. Maybe that'll give me better angles. Or not. <laughs> okay. Use the bathroom. Go get something to eat. We'll step on the dust bunny. Go away the dust pile. <laughs> I've gotten so used to the pregnancies only being two days that having this one be three days feels really weird. Okay, the event is over. She's really tired. I'm gonna have her go upstairs and go to sleep. She won't sleep for long. Oh, the trash can not got knocked over. Let's pick that up. Take a shower. Is there dust upstairs on the floor? No. It's rather clean upstairs. Also, I'm surprised she's sleeping through the speaker being on. But, oh well. So I was thinking, I think what we're gonna do, um, I'm going to play until Monday, which is actually Arya's birthday. We're gonna play till Monday. I'm gonna see if anything happens with Dax at work, if he comes up with like a work rival or um, ends up uh, facing the risk of getting laid off, stuff like that. But I guess, I guess it's a, like a pop-up. Um, I'm gonna sell this. Not but never to resell. Oh, I have a bunch of stuff. I'm oh, look at the little bassinet. Oh, I like this one. Where was the? Oh, it's from the pack. I did not see that one earlier. Hence the reason why I had the werewolves one. No. I want this. Actually, I'm gonna just swap those. I'm gonna put this over here. I did not see this one. I saw um, this one, which I- oh, it's, it was literally right next- oh, but it was locked! It was locked! Oh, that's why I couldn't get to it. That's, and probably- I'm pretty sure it was down here. Okay. Well, I don't like this bassinet, to be honest. I think it looks kind of ridiculous. I think if it had, like, different, like, legs, um, I'd like it more, but I don't like it very much, so I probably won't use it very often. But I like this one. This one's cute. Okay, I got that set up for the baby. Um, I'm kind of tempted to push her into the third trimester already. <laughs> oh wait! No, not in labor! That was accidental, not- gosh dang it, third trimester. I guess we're having a girl. I didn't mean to look at that. <laughs> Well, we're in the third trimester now. <laughs> um, why don't you go upstairs and practice some piano? The people 
are talking The people are saying that you have been playing in my heart Like a grand piano It's not what I was wanting, Dax I want you to get laid off Why are you dressed like- why are, are you impersonating or like cosplaying as Johnny Zest? Cause that's what you look like Maybe that's the joke that's the, that's the comedy of it, it's that he's dressed up like Johnny Zest. The long lost land grab child. Why'd you go outside? Why is the trash can knocked over again? Ooh. Okay, let's go use the bathroom. And then we're gonna put Arya here and see if we can get her to eat something. She didn't eat her pancakes this morning. So I guess we'll see if she eats basically shepherd's pie. Or if she's gonna get all upset about that. Okay, I need you to vacuum, please. She's not going into labor. You're okay. That was an accident. That was my bad. I mean, she's eating it. Oh, she liked it. Oh, sweet. Okay, that's good. And you're eating pancakes. Okay. And then we'll put her to bed. What are you doing? I need you to vacuum upstairs as well. Please. Good sir. Um, also, I don't know if it is broken, <coughs> um, but my sims have not gotten any fears. I know we haven't really come across a lot of fear worthy or like fear inducing things, but my sims have not had any fears yet, like of unfulfilled wishes or dreams or whatever it technically is. Um, so I don't know if that means it's fixed or if it's glitched out. And I should have been getting these things and I just haven't been. Oh, you got pee. You too, me. Okay, I'll probably put her in labor today. <laughs> um, clean this up. I'm gonna put you in labor. There you go. Oh, my notification wall's full. And we are gonna come up here and have a baby. Do -do -do. Here we go. Another girl. Karina, that's pretty. Sure. Arya and Karina. Oh, I might wake up Arya though. Cuddle, maybe bounce. Kiss her forehead. Make a silly face. I'm actually surprised Arya is still sleeping. I doubt she'll sleep much longer, but I am very surprised that she actually is still asleep. Okay. What are we cleaning up? I don't see anything there, but okay. Discuss favorite band. We can do that. Why don't you go play piano? Dex is awake. Okay, let's. Oh, so is Arya. Okay. Um, why don't you go shower, use the bathroom, have some breakfast, and like watch some TV or something. And as soon as he's done showering, oh, she does not like the fact that she has a sibling now. Um, as soon as he's done showering, we'll have Arya go give. Or not Arya. Madison, go give Arya a bath. Okay, he's out. Let's give Arya a bath, please. I think this nightgown is so cute. This looks like something I would have worn when I was little. Like, that's all I wore growing up was just nightgowns. <laughs> I hated wearing, like, sleep pants or shorts, like anything like that to bed. I just wanted to wear like, my nightgowns. And it was, like, the same three nightgowns that I rotated between. What is she wearing? That is not something I gave her. Change her outfit, please. That is not her everyday wear. Excuse you. Oh, did Dax go upstairs? He did. I don't know what he did. Get a promotion. Yep. Um, interests. Discuss favorite band. Why is there so much trash out here? Why don't you go slide? Can infants use the slide? I kind of doubt it, but I do wonder. Oh. Um. Go feed the baby. Oh, Dax is on it. Bottle feed. Kiss her forehead. There you go. Okay. Um. Go. What does he need to do? Write and perform routines. Okay, let's go write a routine. Compose a short routine. What are you doing? Like an awfully proud of yourself for being up in the treehouse. Um, go use the bathroom. 
All right, now we're gonna age up Karina. <coughs> Sorry, I totally missed it too. Calm. These sims like to watch the world, are less likely to cry or become angry, and don't grow tired of activities as easily as other infants. However, they are less likely to explore the world on their own. Just, oh, another brunette. <laughs> She's already smiling. <laughs> Alrighty. I want to see what... I'm. Well, okay, I'm going to go give Karina a makeover, but then I want to see what she and Arya... That's, I don't know what that outfit is. What she and Arya will do together. So Madison is apparently gaining the cheerful trait um, which <laughs> brings us up to five and I think the max that they can like earn is six and Dax also earned the neat trait the other day so well there's that. Um, where is she? Okay so this is Karina. I did give her a birthmark. Um, it's on her neck. She has a port wine stain. But I want to see what they'll do together. Um, actually, hold on. I want her to... We're going to get pictures. So I want her and her everyday wear. Babble. Blow raspberry. Please do not pick her up. Okay, she's cleaning up the bottle. <laughs> like, I want to get these pictures. And I can't do that if you're picking up the child. Blow a kiss. Entertain. Sing a song. Oh, I don't want... Why are you all the way over here? What are you do No! Gosh dang it. Madison, I did not tell you to pick up the child. Okay? It's really annoying that you just did that. Because now she's over here and I don't know that Arya can still do everything with her. See, now she's not doing anything at all. Um, I'm gonna reset. Can I, like, teleport her off of the mat? There she is. Okay. I want to blow a raspberry. <laughs> I want a picture of this, even though... Aria is not in a good mood. Cute. Cute! See, that's all I wanted. Oh, they did not like it, though. <laughs> they weren't a fan. Blow a kiss and maybe entertain her. We're just gonna s sit there and look at her. Why are we not doing anything? Okay, you know what? Just you go build a tower for a little bit. You use the diaper. This is, oh, it's time for a nap. Okay. And I don't have a crib. Sell that. Buy back the one crib that we had. We'll put Blarfy down on the end. Does it matter which way the crib faces? Why? <clears throat> Why? Why? <laughs> now I'm getting frustrated. Give Karina a nap. I've been thinking, I don't, sure. I don't care. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh, we a baby. Oh, she's looking up like, yeah, want to get a picture? Oh, she's getting hungry, though. Oh, she's even on her phone. I relate to this. <laughs> like, when, like, having a baby fall asleep in your arms and you're like, okay, now what do I do? Okay, can you please put Karina down here? Well, she, actually, she's not that tired. Um, can you actually put Karina there? And then feed Arya. Or maybe we'll have Dax do it. Quirk. Oh, Karina hates being held. Karina seems to be partic seems to particularly dislike being held, especially by a non-caregiver. Infants with the hates being held quirk are more likely to get upset when they're picked up and happier to be set down. Interesting. No, that was not for you to eat. Dax. That's for Arya. You can now go eat as well. Look at toys. Okay. Oh, we are asleep here. Reach milestone unlocked. Okay, let's let her out. Use the bathroom. Clean up plates. Okay, why don't you go potty and then upstairs to bed. Okay, so I'm gonna- does Dax even work tomorrow? He does. So I'm gonna let Dax get through his workday tomorrow and if nothing happens with the workday, you know, where he doesn't um, get let go or come up with like a work rival or any of that, I'm probably just gonna end this part here. But we will see what happens. 
Okay, we've unlocked another quirk. Karina is a self-soother. Karina will often try to soothe herself. Infants with the self-soother quirk are more likely to place their little fingers and toes in their mouths to calm themselves when sad or angry, and especially when crying. They will also self-soothe to fall asleep. Self-soothe. So, does she have this because she's a calm, like, she has the calm, quote-unquote, trait? Like, is that why she's a self-soother? Like, do the traits affect the quirks, or are they always just random? Because she's dirty. <laughs> she's really gross. We're going to go give her a quick bath at 12.20 in the morning. And then we'll put her back to bed. Put Karina to bed. I'd really prefer if you were in your bed, Arya. There we go. See if she stays asleep. Okay. And back to bed now. There she goes. Nope. Still awake. There she goes. Okay. Something I haven't used yet is the bat carrier thing. So we're gonna... <laughs> She's... She doesn't like it. Why would you put me here? Karina's sad from being put in some weird backpack thing. What's going on? She's not feeling it. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sweetheart. She's so over it. She's... She's a handful in a completely different way than Arya. Like, Arya was just more of, like, an emotional mess. And I feel like Karina is more of a, like, just don't mess with me. Let me I can do it myself. <laughs> okay, we're going to put Karina down here as soon as we clean up these dishes, I guess. She, or not. Can you please do what I ask? That would be really nice. No? Take Karina out of back carrier? Oh, now we're doing what I say. Play with toys? Okay. Use shower. I'm surprised Arya is still sleeping. Okay. I'll have her try to go night night on the mat when she's done playing. <coughs> Grab milestone is unlocked. Eventually we'll get to a point where we'll be like, ah, yes, and I know what comes next, and I know what happens after that, and oh, yeah, this is what, you know, we gotta work towards next, but I am not to that point yet. Like, I feel like the infants are really flushed out with the pack. I'm, I'm still pretty upset that so much of it is pack and not base game update, but I don't really know what else I can say about it. Oh my gosh, mail does exist! Go pay the bills and get the mail. I haven't seen anything with that. I feel like normally when I play, I get it, I get bills like every four days or so. And I've been playing for over a week and this is the first time I've gotten mail or bills. Okay, I'm gonna give Madison this. I'm going to put the toys in the toy box. I really like this toy box, by the way. Way more than any of the other ones we have. Because the other ones are just, they're like, they're very obviously toy boxes. But sometimes I don't want them to look so much like a toy box. Like, I want them to kind of fit in. Oh, yes, all of her pictures. <laughs> that. What is this? Karina's baby print. Like, okay, those are, so it's hands and just one hand. Okay. Why don't you go vacuum? That'd be nice. That'd be great. Oh, vacuum to perfection. Quirk, heavy sleeper. Aria is quite the heavy sleeper. Toddlers who are heavy sleepers won't wake up as easily from surrounding noises, are less likely to wake up from nightmares, and have an easier time getting good rest. Interesting. For a child who hates going to sleep, she's a heavy sleeper. That makes sense, though, because, like, Aria was, or Karina was fussing overnight, and Aria didn't react, like, at all. Okay. Let's go give her a bath, and then we can feed her. New family dynamic. Oh, the dynamic between Madison and Arya is shifting. No. I want them to keep the one that they have. Okay, he's heading to work. I don't know what this outfit is. And I'm really annoyed that she keeps wearing- Okay, no, she's not in it. Let's put Arya here, please. Get some food. Not for you. Okay. Um... So now I'm just going to see what happens with Dax at work, and we'll go from there. Okay, so Dax is back home from work. He doesn't seem to have any rivalries. He was not being threatened with being laid off or getting laid off. 
So, I'm going to assume that those are kind of rare occurrences. Um, I mean, he's bored from work, but I don't think that's new. Um, so I think I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. I know there's still other things that I haven't messed with. Um, like I never had a, a kid's sleepover. There's uh, something called like a kid's confidence level or something. Confidence skill something. I don't know. <laughs> there's that. There's also the midlife crisis, which I did see is... Um, when they age up into an adult, they will be assigned almost like an, a random aspiration kind of thing. Um, and they have to either ignore the tasks, um, until the time runs out or complete the tasks to like end the crisis early. Um, very similar to the Sims 3 midlife crisis. Um, I'm not going to mess with that though. This video's already gotten plenty long. Uh, there's a couple other events I could host. I think one was like a slumber party, um type thing and I don't remember what the other one is and I didn't really do much with the rec center um but I feel like a lot of that relied on having like pre-existing family in the town or even in the save and I don't it's these two and their kids so with that being said I think that's really going to do it for the week of wow on growing together I feel like I've kind of gotten a good grasp of like the basic stuff that happens in the game um and yeah so um this is the last day of gameplay day five which is going to be on friday is going to be all about my review of the pack my overall review my f overall feelings um, and if I would recommend this pack or not, um, my reasons for recommending it or not recommending it, etc, etc. So, if you're interested in hearing what I have to say for everything I'll put together, um, stick around Friday on Friday for that. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye guys.